A monumental week in the world of Canadian football continues as the Canadian Premier League begins its weekend. Right here, our match of the week from Winnipeg, Manitoba. Valor and Ford renewing hostilities for the 16th time all time at a place that has done nothing but haunt Forge since 2019. Andy Baccaro wears the captain's armband with Andrew Jean-Baptiste on the bench and Diego Gutierrez suspended. Expecting to see Valor in a 4-2-3-1 today. Here is how Bobby Smirniotis lines up today. Looking very different than what we're used to from Forge. A 3-4-3, Olavi Bellarou, James and Samuel at the back. Casey Poku and Ray Zardarama playing as wingbacks today. Adding not only have they had good performances, but they make it difficult on their opposition, especially at home. And he was very adamant, speaking to the media before the match, that this is not the kindest surface to play on either. Very hard turf here at IG Field. It definitely changes the way that they can try and attack and build in transition. Great vision from Kyle Becker to spring Taron Campbell, a step up here. Nelly, right at Yesley Hamilton trying to clean up the scraps. Baccaro on the ball first, and a moment to exhale. The CPL's all-time leading scorer was just about at it again, and that is some vintage Kyle Becker play in midfield. I mean, I know, uh, I know Bobby prides himself on strategic stuff and uh, the capacity to change plans, but the way they play to have the ball all the time does develop players. You have to make decisions all the time. Poku has slept to Campbell. His second big chance of the game. This time it's not a problem to lift it. He lifts it too much. Becker makes the run. And what a run it is. Hamilton's in the box. Becker is in. Hamilton gets a piece to redirect it, but can't find Schoenier or Ray Zartorama. In the end, you hope to find some continuity, especially between your center backs, your back four, I would say, and then you can rotate a little bit up top. Well, just as we sing Baccaro's praises, another turnover. Yes, they had to get up for it. Jordan Hamilton, welcome to the match as he tries a long-distance strike. Exactly. Out swung corner. is a dream touch. And for Guillaume Pianelli, who has battled so long to make it professionally in Canada, that is his first professional goal. Slip to the right side, Taron Campbell, a couple of step overs on Samake, spins around, Ashley Janssen will cross, and Pianelli bails out his keeper as that ball got under his arm. Borges Becker, Borges again. Can't find anybody in orange. Rama collects the loose ball. Borges makes a great run and sends it across. And Forge put over the crossbar. I do really well the hunt and get the ball back. It's a lane for Uloa. Chad Uloa goes low. Campbell looking for the cutback. Novak tries to go through the air and comes up without anything. That's one change of piece now for each of these times. It's amazing how it <laughs> pain dissipates very quickly at times. So now you're going to see if Fami Siage can uh, keep the same momentum up. Well, his teammates are going to help him. Numbers, it's Williams. That's not a good pass all wide. That's Uloa gets the ball anyways. Back towards the spots. As a coach, you're looking at this. As the ball goes out, they're all getting ready. They're all switched on. It's a really positive thing for Valor right now. Borges will test them from the corner field. Left foot and in swinger in to the six. Leslie with a big fist to the ball. Rama back to Borges, keeps it himself. Borges, it's lovely as James sends it across Hamilton. I think a lot of a lot of players, a lot of teams to say you just you can't have those types of performances twice in a row, so they haven't. Good for them. Reacted really well against the top team. 
And here we go again. They're not there yet, but how much better with a third field. See ya. Williams today that had a chance on him was right. Tristan Henry. And that's what I think he's aiming for and going for. And we'll take a little bit here, but this is a big step forward. Here's Ramos Cross. It's going to bounce once in front of Hamilton. Siaj, that's clever as he turns his body into James but couldn't find either Polisi or Sanchez. This is Mandrakar James. Wow. Outside the goal score. That's where it went from Comes up from the referee on the tackle. Campbell tries to block the cross. He's able to nudge one. Yeah, yes, again. Goes up to the nine forge. Three years of age, Ryan Yesley playing like a big boy tonight. But well, this will be the stat that haunts Bobby Smirniotis as Dante Campbell asks for some noise at IG Field. 17 shots from Forge, six on target, and a goose egg. They are through the five minutes of added time. Farrell not lost at IG Field in the last 12 games.